Thank you, Deputy Honourable Speaker. 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 Thank you, Deputy Speaker. Sorry, Honourable Member, Speaker. there's someone speaking here. Yes, Honourable Member, what are you rising on? Yes, I would like to know if the member of the podium is willing to take a question. Bring it on. Why Come are back. you wearing the, uh, the, the EFF regalia in the House? Honourable Member, please proceed. De De Deputy Speaker, I don't think that uh, deserves an answer. I will not honour it. Deputy Speaker, this is that Sobas Bela Panam Sanje is not about Sasa paying out money or grants to the people on the 1st of April. God, this is that Sobas Bela Panam Sanje is a matter of principle. This is that Sobas Bela Panam Sanje is a matter of Abandu from President, where ANC no minister over Tabile Jamine Abanga Funi, Ugumamela e court. While a lot can be said about the social grant crisis, we must not be misled, and South Africans must know. It is only a sick government that is willing to put in jeopardy the only social security that exists for more than 17 million South Africans who depend on these grants for food. It is only when we have a constitutional delinquent as a president that ministers and government official, officials will willy-nilly ignore the constitutional court. What is a fact is that Minister Batabile Damini has done everything in her powers, including Honourable undermining Member. the constitutional court to ensure that the country Honourable has no Member. other option. Please take your seat. Yes, Honourable Member. The Honourable Member on the podium has referred to His Excellency President Zuma as a constitutional delinquent, and we would like him uh, to remove that. It's a political statement, Honourable Member. Thank, Thank you. you. Proceed, Honourable Member. Thank you. It is a fact that the Minister of Atabile Lamine has done everything in her powers, including undermining the Constitutional Court, to ensure that the country has no other option but to continue with the unconstitutional and illegal contract with ECPS. Let alone the fact that this contract has been declared unconstitutional and illegal more than two years ago. What is a fact is that Minister of Atabile Lamine went further to prevent the CEO and SASA and the former DG who resigned because of toxic working relationship with the minister to do the right thing and obey the constitutional court ruling. What is also a fact that is confirmed by the National Treasury and the Minister of Finance at Scopa this morning is a fact that the Minister Batabile Damini has been hell-bent in undermining the National Treasury's assistance in putting and solving the crisis. We are being held ransom, we are being robbed, we are being disrespected, and all of this because of parasitical attitude, greed, and corruption. The ANC is insulting our intelligence, and it is insulting the voters. It is now clear for everyone to see that the ANC is not only anti-black, but is also anti-poor. We are facing here the money laundering scheme by CPS, Greenrod, and Sasa. The 10 million that has been accrued, what are you doing with it? What is the greatest threat? It's not that grants will not be paid on 1st April, but the greatest threat is minister who is willing to be in contempt of the highest court in the land to keep a corrupt and illegal contracts that benefits their friends, their families, and close comrades. Now the step that we must put forward are the EFF want to put on record that we want social grants to be paid on the 1st of April. Not some, but everyone. The EFF reiterate that under no circumstances should SASA and Department of Social Development enter into a contract with CPS or anyone that is in violation of provisions of the constitutions. The EFF calls for Minister Batabi Lejamini to step down with immediate effect to avoid rendering our constitutional order into a mockery. The minister's conduct in this whole saga is not only despicable, but must be condemned. The, e the EFF further calls for the establishment of a state bank with footprint across the country with a cost efficient system to pay grants through its offices, mobile operations, work with the post bank and also more localized government structures such as municipalities. It is such crisis is that reminds Another us why member. is the key government to build capacity and not outsource Another critical member. functions such as expired. payment of social grants. You Another must go.